could only hope to beat him with the help of friends. The Wild Hunt could be defeated with exceptionally powerful magic. So Triss and Yen set out to reconvene the Lodge of Sorceresses. Avalach, too, began to lay plans of his own. The Elven Sage decided to erode the King of the Hunt's support in his own realm. With Geralt in tow, he ventured through other worlds to the city of Tirnaliel. There they found Eredin's viceroy, Gels. Gels had been a loyal subject of the Alder Folk's previous king. When he learned Eredin was a regicide, he agreed to help defeat the usurper. give you a discount for heroic deeds. Greetings, Triss. Have you lost your mind? You went after Imlarith by yourself? the same for Emirates. That's the sole comfort I find in you. But it's no justification. You know what might have happened? But it didn't. I was there. Had the situation under control. Mind if we change the subject? Any success with the Lodge? Anyone out there willing to help? It doesn't look good. Ida outright refused, while Francesca won't budge from her little realm with a war rage. We don't know about Fringilla. Haven't been able to contact her. And the others? Kira, Margarita, Philippa? Kira? I thought you of all people would know. Few can refuse a sorceress. And Kira Metz certainly had her ways. But when she demanded the Mage Alexander's notes, I had to turn her down. Kira needed that. As she needed the impetus to start anew, she found it where she least expected to. Years later, known for discovering the cure for the Catriona Plague, she was thankful none remembered her time in hiding as a village witch. I've seen worse matches. Hope things work out for them. I hope they work out for us, and we actually find Philippa and Rita. We will. We have to. I'll rest easier when they're both here with us. Know where they are? Yennefer's looking into Rita's whereabouts. I have to figure out where Philippa is. So, learn anything? A few things that could be interesting. Prefer the long version or the short? Guess. In short, she was here. At this inn, under our noses the whole time. Transformed, seated on her perch with this dimeridian band on her leg. 
Zoltan's out. Mm -hmm. So why isn't she here anymore? Because Zoltan lost her in a card game a few days ago. Yep, that's Zoltan for you. A man showed up here, fleeced Zoltan Bear, then proposed they play for the owl. Naturally, he won, then politely thanked Zoltan for the game and left. Who was it? You know where he lives? He's not from here. No one knows him. Great. We got any leads? We have this. That Philip of the Owl's feather? Thinking divination? Specifically hydromancy and a form of sorcery. We need a fountain where we won't be disturbed. One outside the Passiflora could work. Good idea. Let's go. We're here. Nice and quiet. Shouldn't be any disturbances. Let's begin. Observe the water's surface carefully. Can't let anything go unnoticed. Graham, that's swear. Robert McKelly, I'll say it. Graham, that's swear. Say Agnes Kelly, as Pirsena, as Clay. Looks familiar. A bathhouse. I know the place. Dijkstra. He has her at his bathhouse. Might have guessed as much. <laughs> Let's go to the bathhouse. Might not be too late. Come on. I hope we get there in time. I hope Dijkstra hasn't already hurt her. The possibilities are many. Could be Dijkstra that got hurt. Not likely. Dijkstra never forgave her for sending assassins after him. And Philip is weakened, no doubt about it. Weakened, maybe. But still a powerful sorceress. If Dijkstra's men take the dimeridium off, Philip will kill them before they can say, oh shit. Long live, etc. She cast a spell on the witch. Oh, no, 
Betray me, and I will... Relax. Not planning on it. Triss is outside. She'll explain everything. Deepest apologies. But the lady will come with me. Deepstra, I don't have time for this. Get out of my way. I've no quarrel with you, Geralt. But Phil and I have lots to talk about. Remember the assassins you sent after me, darling Phil? A grave error. Such matters ought to be handled personally, as I will now demonstrate. Not gonna demonstrate a damn thing. I need her. And I don't give a flying fuck. I've awaited this moment forever, so very sorry, but I care as much about your plans as I do about the snows of Mahakam. Philippa will come with me and answer for all the courtesies she's paid me. Sorry, can't let that happen.
sorry to take so long, but I have to deal with the guards. Hello, Chris. Philip, are you all right? I've been better. I'll get you out of here. It's gonna be all right? Yeah, thanks for your help. Letting such miscreants uh. into the city. Mm. Oh, which are Good of you to come by. What can I do for you? Need some armor made. Witcher's armor.
Take care now. Good of you to need some armor. Take care now.
buy you a drink? I'm afraid the dishwater's as good as it gets in this establishment. Himmleris, was that your idea or serious? an anthem praising your glory. But if you're not in the mood... I thought you'd be angry. Angry? Why? Because you supported Siri in her decision? Or because you fought by her side and won? What if we'd lost? We wouldn't be having this conversation. And the female part of the continent's population would be drowning in tears. You won. No point bothering with what if. find out soon. In the meantime, tell me about Philippa. Triss and I found her and freed her. It turned out Dijkstra had her, but the situation's under control. That's a relief. So, can it tell me why you're here? I was able to establish Margarita's whereabouts, the prison in Oxenford. I also learned the identity of the man who escaped from there. He should arrive shortly. Faria? Who's asking? We'd like to talk. Damn. Oh. Best run and get him. between my ribs. Leave me in the gutter. Look at us. Do we look like bandits to you? No. Not really, no. I'm glad you agree. Besides, you'd be worthless to us dead. So you... you shan't hurt me. No. You're gonna tell us your story, then be on your way. No. Well, so be it. But we, uh, we really ought to go back to Kate's. It's unwise to linger in the street. Drink up. It'll help. Thanks. What do you want? To get into Derard. Hmm. Find 
the hunter. Tell them you practice magic. They'll they'll lock you up lickety split. We need to get in without anyone noticing. Tell us how you escaped, then get on with your life. They say no one gets out of Dayrod alive. Ah, so they say. My thought? Why not try it dead? But they burn the corpses. They didn't start burning them until they learned an old fellow like myself had escaped. Before, they dropped the stiffs into a great pit. The pit's connected to the sewers, and the sewers empty into the river. And once you reach the river, you're as free as a fish. So theoretically, we could get in the way you got out. Assuming we don't mind the company of decomposing corpses. And assuming you can squeeze through the grate. They barred the outlet to the river after I escaped. Huh. Explosives could take care of that. For half the city to hear us? I have a better plan. Oxenfurt was built on elven ruins. Which have to connect to the sewers somewhere. If we can find a way into the ruins... We'll get into the prison. They say Dayrod's better guarded than the keep at Vicovaro. Choose the guards from among witch hunters. The worst dregs, rabid fanatics. If you only knew what they do to folk. Torture every day. The wheel, the rack. We only knew peace on holidays, but they'd drink themselves blind. They're allowed to drink on duty? Oh, not officially, but you know how it is. So hard. One last bit of advice. Find a new tavern. Everyone here knows you. Thank you. Whatever your plans, I hope they work out. So do we. So long. What now? What our friend said about the guards was interesting. Drinking on duty? Zoltan could make sure they have plenty of hooch. Good idea. I'll search for the entrance to the ruins. Let's meet on the Oxenfurt Bridge. Rodanian soldier boys are so tiresome. I'd give you a chance for heroic deeds, but the madam, well, you know. Rather busy noticing that. That's just fine with me. More soldiers, more work. You mean me to grab another lass to join us? No, I was thinking the us two of Oh, that's What we're mistaken. People, help me! Hey, Jack, you're the old man. Eternal fire. Like that. Oh, I'll get you 
copper. Got to be elegant like me. Happiness huh? will come today. I serve the eternal fire. Any help? We'll manage on our own. Shall we begin? Let's do this. You sure the guards don't know about the passage through the ruins? Haven't planted sentries there? They haven't. How can you be sure? Novograd's hierarchs have taken great care to eradicate any and all memories of the city's elven roots. Even if anyone remembers the ruins are there. They have no recollection of how far and where they extend. And I'm absolutely certain no one thought to go safe to Hope you're right. Hamelfart issued some years ago, but I managed to find two brawny and obliging passers-by who agreed to remove the impediment, for a modest fee, naturally. Here. What is this? Use it once you find Rita. I'll be able to pinpoint your location. Not coming? Mucking through ruins and sewers? Hmm, I'd rather leave it to the experts. Meaning you'd rather waltz in once the hard work's done? Wet clothes. No oh, joy.
mechanism is broken. Missing a piece. Replace it with something else, maybe? brittle.
last words.
Who's that? Geralt. God, I'm hallucinating. Getting you out of here. No chance. We'll both die in here. Sheila. They captured her first. Her condition's critical. Pointless. We'll never open it without the key. The warden keeps them with him at all times. His room is upstairs. Be right back.
that dance. What are you doing? Yen insisted on coming. Rita! Sheila! When I get my hands on the sons of bitches... Yenna! I shan't make it. Hold on! You must hold I'm dying, Diana. I'm a sorceress. Let me die with dignity. Yen, we 
should go. Nothing we can do to save her. No, but we can help her die the way she wants to. I won't do it. I will. Come. We must hurry, or we'll lose Rita, too. I can't pass through the portal with you both. You'll need to get out on your own. Don't like portals anyway. Go. We'll deal with the witches. Lolly Jagged Another drifter into Samaria. What's the hurry? I'll give you a discount for heroic deeds, but the madam. Girl. What is it? Nothing just yet, but something's afoot. Philippa and Margarita want to speak to me. They say about what? No, but I have my suspicions. I bet they had plans for me. And they're deigning to inform me of them. Not a conversation you're likely to avoid. I'll go with you if you want. Mm. They'll weigh their words more carefully with you there. Wouldn't be so sure. But two heads are better than one. Let's get this over with. wish to speak? To you, not to Geralt. Geralt stays or we both leave. Let him stay, Phil. He'd learn of it all anyway, eventually. <clears throat> Fine then. So long as he does not interrupt. Think of me as part of the decor. The Lodge once had great plans for you. Important plans. Surely you remember. You were to complete your studies and become one of us. Unfortunately, that did not come to pass. We intend to revive the Lodge, and we renew our offer. You must join us, 
We are saddened our dear Sheila will not join in this endeavor, but the circumstances preclude any prolonged mourning. What is your decision? Will you join us? As before, I'm to marry some princeling and become your puppet. You were a child then, and we misjudged the situation. This time we offer you a partnership. No equality in the lodge. That's garbage. Some have always taken the reins, while others politely nodded. A wise and capable sorceress finds the role, the position that best suits her. And yours should be Sathun. You deserve to lead. Realize, please, that you were made for great things. Work with us and you shall achieve them. Just as soon as we teach you to control your power, channel... I have Avalar for that. You allow this. Do you truly believe his intentions are pure? I don't trust him. I don't trust you. But that doesn't matter. Siri decides. Sages invariably have hidden agendas. Altruism is simply not part of their constitution. You're a tool in his hands, even if you don't see it. We will assure you knowledge and protection. But you shall be your own rudder, captain, and ship. And unlike Avalar, we can promise you this. We don't expect you to commit now. Think it over, what you've heard, what you feel. We will speak when you're ready. If that is all, then... We need to go to Skellige, find the Sunstone. Avalar awaits down at the port. I don't know. I don't really want to talk about it. I'm going for a walk. Help protect Siri from the wild hunt, and the Emperor will grant you amnesty. I hope we can trust you. You can. What a fringilla. That I don't know, but I shall take it up with him. You barely said hello, and you're already plotting something. It's clearly in our nature. Bit about Frangilla. What was that? Triss told me you couldn't contact her. Perhaps because she sits in the Emperor's dungeon, chained in Dimeritium. At least that's what Rita implied. Hmm. Take it the Emperor forgot to tell you about this. I don't like it. That was not our deal. When it's all over, I'll need to have a candid discussion with the Emperor. Come. They're all waiting for us. All are present. You were the last to arrive. Might we set sail? 
anchors away. giant longship that traveled between worlds. As Gels had advised, the Witcher set out to find the Sunstone, an artifact needed to draw Aerodin into a trap. settles the question of his Imperial Majesty's whereabouts. Does he aim to conquer Skelligan? But he, he knows. Those are my friends. He wishes to grant you the Iris with Sintra and the rest of the Empire. There is an upside to all this. Is that so? The Emperor will have to help us fight the hunt. And we just found Frangilla Vigo. We must hurry and find the Sunstone. Seems we've plenty to do in Skelliger after that. Fringilla Vigo. We need her here. Can you teleport me onto Amir's ship? Not a chance. It's better shielded than the Emperor's alcove. Though we could try to force our way through. We need Fringilla in one piece. I'll get on the Emperor's ship myself. A plan to swim? With swords on your back? You'll get shot up like a sitting duck before you can say the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Don't panic. He'll find a way. Make your approach by night. You'll stand a better chance then. And once you're on board, show His Imperial Majesty this letter. Hand it to him directly. We should remind him what he promised and what he'll get in return. At the moment, we don't even know what the Sunstone is. It was created so the Mountain Elves could summon the vessels of the ML. Now it merely serves as a symbol of a lost opportunity to unite the two tribes. Truly? Can all of you be unfamiliar with the story of Galban and Dillion of the White Fleet? The Sunstones in Skellige? How do we know that? From legends. Elven ones. It lies where the White Fleet landed centuries ago. Meaning anywhere on any one of the Isles. Splendid. Ermion. I'll talk to him. Know where he is? I'll ask around the port. Croc's longships are moored there. I'm off. Good luck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I heard the note to a white near the city. I'm not sure what you did first. The big 
dirty oof. Slip that traitorous bitch's throat where he alive. And we should have drowned that whelp in deep water the day he was born. Looking for Hermia. Oh, he's in there with him. Pale as a beach carp. If he don't bring the brat in line, who will? But no, he says, the gods gave us a king. We must support him. Support what? Svanriga standing there like a mute fencing dummy. Gazing on as that hack sells us to the black ones. Berna Brand arranged everything behind our backs. Why, well, she's not even denying it. Ah, I refuse to look upon this disgrace. We shall discuss the details later. His Majesty accepts the document in its current form. Never thought I'd live to see the day. We are prepared to seal the treaty. How much would I need to pay you to take off her head here and now? Nothing to be done. It's too late. The King pledges to fulfill all the conditions by the summer solstice. Before I sign, I wish to hear this from the king's mouth. Van Riga.
we move out at once. You hear what the king said? Move! Svanliga, who could have known? The Jarls are one they can believe in again. And who brought you here? Come to make sure no scandal in Skellige passes you by. Listen, Ermion. Know anything about the Sunstone? Legends place it somewhere in Skellige. The Mask of Orberus first know the Sunstone. Monsters may rest easy. You become a treasure hunter. I've never found the Enshe Elves interesting. But there's a scald, Avent. He could help you. Once told me of some inaccessible caverns or ruins or some such. Where will I find him? Today, in Arambjorn, doubtless. You might ask the Pearl Divers, Erling and Matthias Fishlung. Of late, they hunt near the tip of the bay, eastern end. Fishlung? Interesting. So they call him. Submerges for hours at a time. None know how he does it, but I've my suspicions. Hmm. Not too fond of him. That's nothing personal. I couldn't stand his father or grandfather either. Thanks for your help. Uh, one thing, Geralt. These caves are ruins. Matthias and Erling's ancestors would have looted them bare centuries ago were they not protected by some magic barrier. Take a sorceress with you. You must have brought at least one along. Oh, gaggle this time. Blah. Gods protect us. Adventure speaker. Not now. Watching for Nilfgaard's fleet. Fleet? Oh, aye, they mentioned something. Nay, I have more important matters on my mind. By my calculations, today's the day Givorg, the legendary white whale, will swim the waters of Skellige. Been waiting for this my whole life. Let's watch for Geborg together, and you can tell me what you know about any elven ruins in Skellige. Heard of some cavern no one's been able to enter? Good thing, too. 
Elsewise, you'd have pondered it long ago like all the others. Avent, what? I... Uh, just wanted to assure you I only want to look around the cavern. It's research. Research? Writing an adventure novel. Gathering material for it. Mean to write up the coming of the White Fleet? Try, my dear. Perhaps you could use my translation of the Song of Gilban and Dillion. Gladly, gladly. So where's this cavern? Got a sail east from Kertrolda. Caverns in a cove, only accessible from the sea. So long, and good luck with the White Whale. It'll show today. I'm sure of it. Such thing as bad ships or bad weather. Only worthless fucking sea. Don't you ask a man in need. That arse is all mine. Heard the nail through bites yesterday. Oh, I'd right. rather verify it now. Going somewhere? Siri says there's a site in Skellige we must examine. Avalok's clearly hiding something from us. Earlier, when we were in the aisles together, Avalok mentioned a laboratory. At one point, he wished to teleport there, to retrieve something. And he refused to take me with him. It was all very strange. Sufficiently suspicious, don't you think? Making too much of it. Avalok's as secretive as any elf. What are your suspicions, exactly? I... I don't know, Geralt. I have a feeling it's important. Come with us. Fine. Where is it? On a small isle between Undvik and Spikarog. Not exactly on our way. Just found out the sunstone's on Ard Skellig. A cavern along the coast that we can only access from the sea. Gonna need some real magic to get in, too. Go find this laboratory. I'll explore Ard Skellig. You can join me later. Philippa, your eyesight. Only just recovered and magically simulated. Didn't you say you'd need some time to get accustomed? Did I? well protected. I believe we'll find something interesting inside. How will you lift the barrier? So, any incriminating letters? Closets full of skeletons? We've not even opened the door yet. 
It's a highly complex magic barrier. Let's try it. Yatta Ligon! I'll take care of it. nothing. We must look around. It's a bit low, isn't it? Rummaging through his papers. You wish to come, my dear. Portrait of Siri, I think. No, that's not me. Where's the scar? It's definitely you. Hm. Really captured you. Sure, Avalok's only interested in you for your magic abilities. <laughs> Very funny. Chart of the Enhanicare, the Elder Blood, from Laura Doran. To me. You never showed me the full version. I had no idea Beedmont of Eden was an ancestor. Was he the one who punished his daughters with a hot iron? Or the one who had his own father's eyes gouged out? Him of the daughters. My, even I'd never seen the full version. Seems Avalak has analyzed all the paths of Lara's gene, even those we thought extinct. Let's look at his notes. God, he spent over two centuries on this. He was the first to study Lara's genes. Vulcan? Hmm. Some entries about Siri, but it's here later that things get interesting. He actually tried to cultivate a genetic mix like Siri's, but one excluding the human line. 
Meaning what exactly? That I ought to be looking about for giant jars holding my siblings? Don't be foolish. Avanaf never got that far. Apparently, all his experiments ended in failure. You are unique. And that's why we've the wild hunt to contend with. Let's stir it on. See if we can't find something even more interesting. Standard. Might have expected a hidden portal. Hmm. I'll sure know their fragrances. How did you get in here? Not your concern. Get out of here. Now. You. I remember you. From Tir Nalia. Remarkable. I thought all elves looked alike to those of your race. If it's Avalach you seek, he's not here. I know. And yet you come here. What for? To spy on him. He tries his damnness to save you every time you do something stupid. Is that not enough? What can you possibly know about that? You'd be surprised. He's told me a great deal about me. Like what? He said you shared Lara's features. I don't see whatever it is he sees. It seems a bit like trying to drink water from a mud puddle. <laughs> I imagine that belief somehow helps him with his task. What task? Do you think he trails you everywhere for pleasure? Even I grow ill at the sight of you. It's incredible how those like you still believe you're superior to humans, in any way. She's no human. She's a degenerate half -breed. To have no choice but to use something like that? It's humiliating. Another word, and I'll... What? You'll change nothing. She must do what she must. Then Avalach will finally be free of her. If he hates me so deeply, why didn't he tell me to my face? Siri, you didn't actually believe her, did you? She's a... Personally involved in the matter, that's clear. What of it? If they despise me so, they should leave me be. Theory. What? Do you fear I'll level this place like I did Care Morn? Shame I can't do that at will because I really like to now. Calm down. The elf was right. <sighs> Aren't you supposed to cheer me up? You carry Laura's gene. Nothing you can do about it. Inherited her talent and her power, too. That she elf would give up a century of her life to be you. Certainly didn't seem so. You were born with a great gift, and only you can decide how to use it. What's that? A necklace. Laura Doran's. It's beautiful, but... Yours, to wear. Let's go. I'm sick of this place.
Must we return to the boat right away? Something else you want to see? Not here. On Hinderfjall. In Lofoten. I met a young man, Skjall. And I'd like... What is it, Siri? Skjall is dead. The wild hunt. Everyone? No one survived? Skjall died later. You're sure it was him? You'd met him? I was there. I saw his body. Will you visit his grave with me? I'd like to... to say goodbye. I'll go with you. Thank you. Could you open a portal to Hindisfjall? I can. Let's do this. Come back soon, all right? Mm -hmm. See you. Look around. Should be a relatively fresh grave mound. Thank you for coming. I detest graveyards, especially wandering them alone. Graveyards, not my favorite either. Why not? Remind me of work. Never been to a cemetery to visit someone's grave. Always hunting some ghoul or rot fiend. Oh, frankly, I'd rather have come here with a contract. To do some witch's work. Lasse, son of Njord. Olaf, son of Ova. Inga, daughter of Chortnir. Damn it. He's not here. Skjell has no grave. Skjell, I shan't leave until I bury him. Think, the body. What could have become of it? They didn't burn it. Save that honor for kings and heroes. Doubt they left him in the garden, too. Hmm. Uh, bastards. What? Beyond the village. There's a pit. They fill it with sheep taken by blacklegs. Crabs stick at their bones at night. What are you doing? What you should have done long ago. We're burying Skjall. Burying Craven? You defy the right of the elders. Be gone. Leave this place. You defy our laws. We're not bound by them. Aye, and you've clearly no respect for our customs either. Craven's place is in the ditch. Skjall saved your bloody lives. The wild hunt was after me. Had Skjell not led me away then, why they would have reduced Lofferton to ash? What would the spectres be wanting of some lass who... I am not some lass. And anyone who so much as touches this grave will learn that the hard way. Hey, none will disturb it. Desecrating graves. Well, it's the only thing elders punish harder than fleeing the battlefield. And what you said... Can't know the truth of it. The gods will judge Skjall now. We were right to come. I was deeply troubled. No idea. Well, they shouldn't spit on his name anymore. Let's go. That 
to the boat. Oh. Would you have a man in me? Clearing up. Take the boat! Shoot! Wait, Harley. I'm a... Damn it. 